My name is George McLaughlin, I'm the physio of Associates, you're watching Mariners TV. So Johnny got Bertie on Saturday, it's something to build on now from Monday's game, isn't it? Yeah, hopefully we can get another three points on board, uh, home game. Um, obviously played them a couple of times already. Last time I think we beat them 3-0 in the, in the, um, in the Ernest Armstrong Cup, mm. I think. Um, so yeah, obviously they're no strangers, you know, they've uh, got good forwards. Um, they had a couple of players missing as well. Um, last time we played them, so I think there'll be a lot sterner tests than there were in the Cup game. It's the first of three home games, isn't it? So you must have a, a, a good target in your mind of getting nine points if you can. Yeah, that's, that, that would be the target, you know, yeah. if I'm saying anything to the players, but I'm not jumping too, hard, too far ahead of myself, you know, let's just take one game at a time um, and let's get three points on Saturday. If we can get three points on Saturday, then you move on to the next one and the next one, but at the moment we're just concentrating on getting three points on Saturday. That's what it's proved this season, isn't it? I mean, you've, you've beaten some of the top sides and lost to some of the ones near the bottom, so anyone can beat anyone really can't if you're not on your game yeah of course you know as I've mentioned to you before if you're, if you're not right mentally which um, in large parts of the season we haven't been um, then you'll get beat you know I mean just proves that the last time we played to him against Anik we weren't right mentally you know I thought we could just go on the pitch and win the game and it, it doesn't work like that you know so I've tried to get across to the players that you whenever you cross the white line you've got to have that winning, winning mentality like a few of the players have um, but um, we need we need 9, 10, 11 players play on Saturday we cannot have any passengers and if we have 10, 11 players playing you know to 8 or 9 out of 10 we'll win the game you know mm. if we're carrying 3 or 4 players we'll lose the game you know and I mentioned that lads on Saturday that on against Eshwin we didn't carry any players and we need we need that again on Saturday you know and you go into the game 15th in the table it looks like that's probably the highest you can finish but there's still a lot to play for you know, like points totals and, and games won at home that sort of thing yeah of course um, I, mean, I don't think we're going to catch Dalton or now you know they're 9 points ahead you know with a similar goal difference um, so I mean there's lots of targets which I'll be seeing to the lads you know one of them is uh, I think we've won 7 games at home and lost 10 so mm -hmm. we, let's try and get 10 games win at one, one at home you know to even obviously the, the losses out as well and let's get the goal difference up you know and um, obviously, obviously again you want to you want to win the last 4 games of the season so there's lots of there's lots of targets there. The biggest target for me is, you know, it's the lads who, who want to be at the club next season. You know, that's they've obviously got to be showing me in the next in the next three games that they really do want to be part of things in the summer. You know, just wearing Stephen Huber as well. I mean, he's had to wait for his chance again, hasn't he? But he took it with both hands the other day. Yeah, I thought he was outstanding. You know, um, he's in bed with the flu at the moment. You know, he's uh, he's laid up. You know, but he, he thinks he'll be okay for Saturday. But I thought he's he'd done very well on, on Saturday. He didn't have a lot to do, but what he did have to do, you know, they're massively important. You know, he made some excellent saves. I mean, one was I think he made two one-on-one -on -one saves, which mm. which kept the lads in it. You know, but um, that just goes down to us not being clinical. You know, if it wasn't for Stephen, them um, saves that he made, you know, it could easily be another way where they scored, and it could have cost us. You know, through not being clinical. And I've mentioned that in the past. Mm. Um, so we need to be a lot more clinical and front of goal because we are creating lots of chances I think on Saturday we create six seven chances you know really really good chances and we've got to learn to take them you know and mm. if we can take them then obviously the games will be a lot more comfortable you know because it got a bit edgy towards the end on, on Saturday and it, and it shouldn't have been just wearing the spirit in the camp as well I mean it's been up and down the season but the, the spirits always seem to, to stay quite high especially in the training sessions yeah yeah they're, they're a good set of lads you know what I mean and um, we had another good session there tonight you know it's good to see some of the some of the under 18s to uh, train again tonight you know doing very well and they're going to be the future of the club so so yeah, yeah, we, we they have got a, a good um, a good team around at the moment, you know. But um, that, that can sharp go, you know, if, if we don't get uh, results, you know. So hopefully we can get another good result result on Saturday and another three points and and uh, move on um, with uh, with more goals, if you like, and mm. and then try and get that goal difference to the plus rather than, than the minus, you know. Just finally, Jenny team news for for Saturday. Um, Baptiste, he's still out. He's going to be out for a week. Paul Kane's away at a wedding. Um, we should have Chris Renshaw back. We should have Michael Turner back. Um, and hopefully Gary Crottle. He's uh, he's. I've been mean, wanting to give Gary some minutes, you know, but he's he's uh, getting himself injured. I think last night in five aside. But has uh, been on the phone to him tonight, and he thinks hopefully he's going to be okay for Saturday. So so yeah, hopefully them and three four players to come back in.